What's going on guys, it's JJ, back with another NASCAR 14 video, and today, I guess, is the Daytona 500, race 1 of 36. <coughs> so, no, I'm not single player. Career. Alright, schedule, and I'm pretty sure it's the Daytona 500, yup. I don't need any practices. Yeah, whatever. I don't need any practices, but I will set up the weekend. And you can see, like, what I will set up. Actually, I might do one practice and, like, pause it, and then, like, I'll unpause it once I'm done with practice. Average finish 11,000, the Daytona Duel. I mean, it's not a great finish, but it's not a bad finish. Since there's only, like, 20 cars. So it's like in the middle, so it's not that good. But then. It was because freaking Josh Wise, like, took me out. Go check out the last video of the Daytona duel. Alright, so yeah. 60, 65, I guess is good. 60% give. Practice time, yes. No. Um, 10% race length. Um, yep, everything else is good. Yeah, okay. And I'll um, begin practice three, and I'm going to pause it, and I'll unpause it once practice three is over. Okay, so I'm back from practice three. I'm back from practice three. Um, let me take a quick recap what happened. I mean, <coughs> it's not what to say. Um, I got the fastest lap time of 46.03. With an average speed of 194 miles per hour. Greg Biffle had the best time for a while. Until everyone else just started getting better laps. Matt Kenseth also had it for a while. Until me and Cole went, drafted together and got a good lap. And, and some other people probably didn't catch any draft. For example, like, like yeah, these people... 178, 178, 176, 177, what? He got, what? How is his lap time better if he is a, whatever. I don't care. So, 174, 174, 173, and 173. So, some people didn't, must have not got caught the draft. Whew, bad for Casey Muse. Who was bad for? AJ Omdinger, bad for... Eric Amarola, bad for Ricky Stenhouse. Ooh, that's a that's a glitch. It should say 179.4, but instead it says 178. 78.5, what the heck? It's supposed to say 179.5. Alright, whatever. So, anyway, um, about halfway into the practice, I caught on to Cole Witt, um, and we started drafting together, and we got fast laps, so that's basically it. So I'm going to skip um, to the Daytona 500. Skip to the race. Yes, I'm sure. Now let's let the commentators talk. Okay, bud. You've worked hard to get to this point. Now, go out there and give it your best shot. Yes. Now we let the commentators talk. Professional sports only NASCAR begins with its biggest event. Welcome to Fox Sports coverage of the Daytona 500. I'm Mike Joy with Hall of Famer Daryl Walter. Mike, the Daytona 500, the great American race. It's the Super Bowl. It's the World Series. It's the Kentucky Derby, all rolling into one. The 500 has always been the biggest race of any season. It has, Mike, and there's the guys that are favorites, but I, I love Dale Jr. in this race. This track means a lot to the Earnhardt family, and I'd love to see Dale Jr. in this thing. All right, 200 laps. Let's go. <clears throat> okay, let's go. I have Danica on my outside. Wait, how am I on the pole? How did I win the pole for the Daytona 500? That doesn't make sense. Anyway, Paul Menard's gonna immediately give me a shove. Hi, Paul Menard. He's still on you. 
Very, this is exciting. I love the Daytona 500 just like probably everyone else does. Alex Bowman in second. Comes Paul Menard on the outside. No! Comes Kyle Larson on the inside. No, Paul Menard's not going to get around me. It's going to be close. Is he going to get around me? I thought it was a good idea to go low. No, dang it. Paul Menard's clear of me. Ooh, Danica almost made it three wide for the lead. Oh, gosh, no, Larson's faster. No, Palm Nard, I'm there. Three wide for the lead. Already. Oh, my gosh, Alex Bowman almost made it four wide. Don't do that. <laughs> you don't want to go four wide at Daytona. You can only do that at Tower Baker. There we go. The back stretch is like... When you're in, on the back stretch, when you're in the front, it's nice and calm. But like when you're in the middle of the pack on the back stretch, there could be a, some kind of wreck. All right, I'll stay with Larson because he seems to be faster. No, oh, never mind. Austin Dillon. Now Larson, and then go down for Dillon. Everyone wants to push me. Wow, the pack is still all together. Ooh, who's that? The Boyer. Oh, I gained a little bit of a lead right there. Oh, gosh, Clint Boyer, it's such a run. Oh, man. Gosh dang it. How are so many people getting such big runs? Ooh, someone got into the back of Ryan Newman. It almost caused a wreck. All right, well, Clint Boyer is now leading the Daytona 500. Inside. This is exciting already. Dave Reagan gets the fastest lap. Push, push, push. It's funny how I slow down when I'm when I'm flooring it. No, it's not funny. I don't like that. I want to go fast. I want to go way faster than this. Now everyone's gonna get a run on me. Really? Be just before everyone was going like almost 200. Okay, this guy's definitely. Oh, he waited for me. Thank you. No. No, you don't. <coughs> Here comes Ryan Newman on the low side. Alright, so I've been in the front most of the race. Clint Boyer led one lap. Hold on, I gotta pause it real quick. I'm gonna get the, um... The sheet of like what people has of cars. I meant like pause the race. Um, where is that sheet? Gus, did you destroy it? You better not have just. No! Stop it! Stop putting the paper, guys! Gus is my cat. Hold on. Okay, so I found my sign up sheet. Um,. What the cars people pick. Um, let's see. Yeah, no one has Newman, Sandhouse, or Mears because that, I didn't put that on them on the list. Because I didn't think they were good enough. But in this race, apparently anyone can win it. It's most likely going to be me. Just saying. Because all these guys don't know how to floor it. I mean, some of them do. Like Brakazowski just up the middle. Go you. Uh, Joe check yeah, definitely Kozlowski. Oh, Ooh, who's that on the low side? Denny Hamlin just shoved right. Brakazowski up the racetrack. No one has Denny Hamlin. Someone has Kozlowski. I think it was Luke Rainey. Right yeah, you. he is Brad. 
No one is Truex, no one is Hamlin. Oh, who's that here? Oh, that's Truex. He took me out, um, my last race. I saw the video, and he actually did move up. But, like, just from the race replay, it didn't look that way. No? Oh, it's getting tight. Oh, no. Ryan Blaney's coming in. No! Trevor Bain and Landon Castle's got me inside. Uh, oh my goodness. Uh, it's tight. The three wide. Alright, Landon Castle gets to the inside. Uh -uh, I'm in the middle. There we go, okay. Trevor Bain. Alright, I'm staying low. So I'm kind of scared of what's happening right now. Alright, there we go. Trevor Bain has nobody helping him. There's no way he can pass. Oh, he's got a good run. Oh, no. Nope, he didn't get it. Oh, my gosh, he got shuffle back. Who is Harvick? Someone has Harvick. I know it. I think it's 10 fan 88 that has Harvick. I can't really check right now because I'm, I'm kind of three wide. Right. Yep, 10 fan 88. Oh, four wide. Oh, that doesn't work. Oh my gosh, why? Don't go four wide. It's not what you're supposed to do. You're not supposed to go four wide at Daytona. And I don't know why the heck the AI does that. No one else does. I'm perfect, you deserve it. Sorry, 10 fan 88 for that. Let's go. Okay, let's make my way back through this field. I'm in 26 now, so that's not that bad. No, I can make this work. I can get back up there in nine laps. Just like Dale Sr. He was all the way back here and he made his way up there in like like four laps. He was in like 12 and went up to like went up to first in like four laps. If I can be in 23rd and go up there in nine laps then I can definitely. Oh gosh, no, Trevor Bain just made it three wide. I know that. Alright, this last one. Okay, let's go to the middle. Oh gosh, no one's going with me. Stop shoving me! Oh god, Kurt Busch, can you please move? Why? This, the AI is so stupid! Like, Josh Wise just came off the racetrack when he wasn't even clear. Why is the AI so stupid? I'm not gonna make it four wide because that's just dangerous. The controller is vibrating a heck lot, so let me just get out of line for a sec. Nope, let's not do that. Let's not be three wide in the middle. Oh god, okay, for a second I thought there were four wide up there. Tony Stewart, what are you doing? The last Daytona 500 was in 2015. Oh my god. Okay. This is crazy. Oh gosh, everyone's just shoving each other. Oh, there's Harvick again. Come on, dude, let's make our way up there. Me and you. Sorry. Sorry about that. AI. My controller is vibrating a lot again. So let's jump out of line for a second. And get back in. Ugh, stop shoving each other. Nice pass, man. Keep working. I'm in the middle of the pack. How, what am I supposed to do? Everyone's just checking up. Oh, the AI is so stupid. How am I supposed to get up there? I'm just stuck. 
I can't go anywhere because everyone's freaking checking up. Okay, I gained a spot. Oh, yes, it's too wide. That means that's good. That's very good. Where'd Harvick go? Oh, he's back there a little bit. Oh, I'm barely catching Palmnar's draft. I don't know why, but, like, this inside lane's working a lot. Holy cow. No, Johnson. No, you're not clear. Now you are. Gosh, Johnson just got a huge run. Dang. Ooh, yes, I'm getting up here. I'm in the top 15. Oh, come on. Come on, let's get up there. There's only six to go. You know what? Three wide. Three. Yeah, that's right. I just made it three wide and it worked. If you go three wide and then turn, it'll, and you're on the inside, it'll work because everyone will just move down to the bottom lane. If you do it on the back stretch, most likely no one's going to go with you. Exactly. Same problem with Pulmonard. Perfect example, except Casey Kane who made it three wide and now I'm stuck in the middle. Great, we're three wide again. And the middle lane's checking up. Ooh, why? Michael Waltrip, come on, go. I don't want to get stuck back here again. You know what, four wide. I have to get in line somewhere. No, Jeff, not clear. Okay, it worked. All right, I'm at the bottom. Five to go, I don't know how I'm going to make this happen. Four wide to the turn. Ain't nobody gonna, ain't nobody got time for this. Oh god, this is bad. Four wide. It's working! Yes! I'm up here! Yes! Oh my gosh, how did I just do that? Top five, more like first place! Oh yeah, back up in the lead. I told you I can do it. Man, with five laps to spare, I still, I just gotta hold the lead. Not make any stupid mistakes. Now it's just block. Block everyone. Block everyone who has runs. Tony Stewart style at Talladega, but failed. And almost flipped over. He went on his side on top of everyone else. See? Block. Block. The 23's run. No. He's trying to make moves. Can't. Yeah, he's like right at my bumper. Like, you could see his, like, Dr. Pepper logo at the top of his car. Oh, he is all over the place. Comes Johnson through the middle. His pack is spread out a little bit. Oh, man, two people lost the draft. I wonder who those guys were. Johnson. No one has Johnson. Come on. No. Yes. Okay. Boom. Go. Block. <laughs> my parents, my my family is playing Pokemon Go in the background. You have to know what Pokemon Go is. It's like the most popular game of, of August. No. It's all over the place, just like the 23 car. High car on the high side. I would have laughed if that was Paul Menard. But that was David Reagan. It's just me and Johnson. Ooh, Jeff Gordon launching up here. Racing Fan for Life 18. Eyes on you. He in fourth. No one's really making, like, big moves. I mean, Johnson makes some moves, like, on the, on, like, the straightaways. Like, see, he ducked to the inside. He ducked way inside. But I blocked him. Oh, and now they're too wide behind me. Hey, look, Gordon's up to third. Racing Fan for Life 18, this might be your day. No! No, you will not. Oh my gosh, here comes Jeff. He had to run. I, I was not ready. No, Johnson. You're, you stay behind me. Oh god, Johnson. Break checked. Oh no, Jeff Gordon shuffling back. <laughs> Alright, no one is Tony Stewart. I mean, I put it on the list because I know that, like, he always somehow gets in the front in the NASCAR 14 Let's Play. Here we go. Oh my gosh, no! No one's going with me. Oh, that's the Daytona 500 right there. Oh gosh, everyone's going so slow. Come on, guys, push. Faster, faster. Come on. Yes, outside, outside. 
There we go, Junior. You're the best. I'm gonna go with you. Let's go, let's go, let's go. Me and you, Junior. Come on. I wanna clear Gordon. No, don't you. Yo, Gordon! Oh my gosh, that wasn't even my fault. I can't believe you. Oh my gosh. I could have won this race, but Gordon just took me out. I was trying to go through the middle. Gordon knew I was there, but like... Uh, that's not a way I wanted to finish the race. I wanted to win that. Well, it should have been five seconds ago. Alright, start the race. Let's go to jump to highlight real quick. So this was the first caution. When um this is a bad view. Um when Harvick took me out. I saved it, but I I think Harvick like spun off the racetrack somewhere. This is real time. Let's go to the next one. Let's go to the wreck on the final lap. Alright, let's see this. No, wait, no. I know a very good view. It's not here. It's, it's not Kyle Larson. Driver side. Now let's watch. Look how much room. Look how much room he has over there. But he didn't use it. And watch what happens. He spins out. <sighs> Not very happy. Truck side. And then a huge wreck behind me. Gosh, that was a big wreck. Alright, now let's see the race results. Finished fifth. That's not bad, but still not the way I wanted to end this race. I know, I kind of wanted to save that race replay. Race replay. Save. going on for a long time and then it has to save the race five seconds later it's done there we go didn't take too long when you sure you want to wish the re replay mode any unsaved replay footage will be lost I saved it so you don't have to worry about that results. Alright. Dale Earnhardt Jr. got fourth. Um, Tony Stewart won the race. I knew it. So I, I, I kind of wanted you guys to get Tony Stewart. He, he won the race. Um, gosh, Ryan Truex second, David Gillen third. Dale Earnhardt Jr. fourth. 10 fan 88, good day for you. I got fifth. Um, Kevin Harvick, another 10 fan, eight, four, 10 fan 88, so good day for him. Fourth and eight, fourth and eighth, both top 10. Um, nobody got Matt Kenseth, nobody got Austin Dillon or Joey Logano or Denny Hamlin. Wait, 
Yeah. Kyle Busch, that's Racing Fan for Life 18, 19th. Not too bad. Um, who else was it? Someone had Brad. Um, that's Luke Rainey. And the last one, Jeff Gordon, who oh, 38th. He was the one who took me out, Racing Fan for Life. <laughs> Why'd you pick Jeff? Jeff took me out. Oh well, um, anyway. Thanks for watching this video. Um, make sure to check out the um, the first um, race of the NASCAR 14 Let's Play, the duel. Um, so anyway, yeah. Thanks for watching this video, and see you in the next one.